Latest now on an aircraft carrier crisis. The Navy is taking action to protect sailors after a cluster of suicides on the USS George Washington and troubling reports about conditions aboard the warship. Stephanie Ramos has the story. As early as today, the U.S. Navy will help relocate some 260 sailors off of a massive aircraft carrier, the USS George Washington, after a rise in crew suicides and reports of terrible working conditions. The warship has been docked in Virginia since 2017 for a major overhaul. But in the last year, seven sailors assigned to it have died, four of them apparent suicides. Sailor Xavier Hunter Sandor was found unresponsive on the ship with a self-inflicted gunshot wound April 15th. His parents tell us the young man told them the conditions on the ship were bad, but they didn't know to what extent. This can't happen to any other sailors. It's not fair when these boys and girls sign up to enlist to serve their country. It's not fair. Last week, the Navy's top enlisted leader telling sailors there is indeed a problem heard here in audio obtained by the Military Times. I understand that we saw the problem and the department has been focusing on it, but the problem is Getting suicide is like getting cancer. It's trying to, there are many different causes, many different reasons. In a statement, the Navy says the death of any sailor is one too many, and we will thoroughly investigate these incidents to ensure we are providing the appropriate support and resources to sailors at sea and in the shipyards. Following the deaths, the Navy says they put in place immediate mental health support, including a psychologist and social worker to provide services to those on the ship. TJ. All right, Stephanie, thank you so much. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching. And we'll see you in the morning on GMA.